Nothing's more annoying than trying to play your favorite mobile game and realizing you can't because you don't have an internet connection. Sadly, more and more games today require Wi-Fi to play, even if you don't want to use online features. So today, we are talking about 15 iOS Android games that don't need Wi-Fi. So starting off with number 15, we have Rage City. It's an open-world game where the player's main job is to create destruction and other several jobs as a thief, stealing cars, secret packages, while using lots of weapons and guns. Rage City is a game full of action and no breathtaking content, but graphics in the game are designed in a humorous cartoon style that makes the whole game look calm and suitable for many ages. Moving right along to number 14 with Roaring Racing. It's a game that focuses mostly on racing. You'll be racing around corners trying to get an edge against your opponents. It comes with different difficulties based on skill level. There are usual features including cars to unlock, campaign mode, various tracks, and tuning options. Go! To number 13, we have Emoji Adventure. It's a puzzle adventure game where you have to play this game smartly and cross all the maze without coming in front of anyone. Also, you must collect more coins to score more and upgrade the skill of your character, like stealth and other abilities, with that coins. Besides, the game offers lots of levels and fun puzzles, which the game very fabulous. Overall, the graphics and controls of this game are pretty good. Moving right along to number 12 with Shuyan Saga. It's a graphic novel with a 3D combat system. The graphic novel is represented through comic art style drawings that are beautifully done. It has plenty of interactive dialogue choices with a rich Chinese style. The kung fu elements come alive through the 3D combat system. The moves and the game feel is good, and having one-on-one -on -one combat and group combat has enhanced the variety of ways to play. In addition, it is a very creative idea to combine a combat system with a graphic novel. Down to number 11, we have Legend Arya. This is a survival shooting game in which you control your player with only one hand. The gameplay of Legend of Arya is so simple, you only control your hero's movement. He will take care of the rest. The only downside of the game is level missions are short. Besides, it's a good free-to-play game for time-killing on the go. Come on, baby, let's go! Moving right along to number 10, we have Flight. It's an indie game, features a relaxing, meditative flying adventure with dynamic day and night. The first thing you'll likely notice about Flight is how great it looks. Besides, you become a monk that turns into a raven to venture the scenic open world based on Nepal. The downside of Flight is the game offers no mission, so you roam around and enjoy the environment, but for a paid game, it's not worth it. At number 9, we have Night Speed. This is an arcade racing game featuring a procedural track generation, which makes this game very brilliant and energetic. You can take your car up and unlock a lot of customized parts. Also, the game offers several soundtracks during the race that really enhance the joy of racing at that time. In short, you have to drive your car in the night condition and win the race. 
Moving right along to number 8 with Battle Royale Fire Force. It's a BR game features solo, team fight, and team deathmatch mode. Give the player a thrilling, dramatic sensation. The gameplay is simple. Each match will have a lot of participants in solo or team form. Your task is to find every way to become the final survivor person on the island. Fire Force offers some elements of free fire in Fortnite like skydiving with surfing board and weapon bag. The downsides of the game are countless but under 150 megabytes, we getting a BR. Down to number 7, we have MM2 Racing. It's a racing game where you will race with the bus. In each race, there are four buses, and your main objective is to overtake all the buses and finish the line first. There are six different tracks and five different classic buses available in the game that you can unlock with progression. Overall, the graphics of this game is super, and download size of the game is small. Moving right along to number 6, we have Vikings War. This is a role-playing game where you will play a role of Viking leader and conquer the known world. You expelled from your kingdom, you go in search of adventure. You will explore mysterious places to get the most powerful items in the game and attack on enemies to gain power. Every level are dynamic, they change every time you play them. Also, it has short missions of a few minutes. Overall, the graphics are decent and controls are good. At number 5, we have Sky Duels. It's an aerial arcade style flying endless open world game. The gameplay is simple. You have to shoot down the planes, blimp, jet, and many more. It's an unapologetically simple game with sharp controls, challenging gameplay, bright and attractive aesthetics. Overall, I'd say it's worth a download. Down to number 4, we have Runic Curse. This is an action RPG game where you will play the role of a boy whose name is Adrian. He wakes up on an unknown island that has been overtaken by the so-called Runic Curse, and his mission is to find out what happened to his crew on the island with a terrible fate. The game features dynamic combat system with stamina management and roles. You can level system with a selective increase of characteristics, equipment, and abilities. In addition, the game has several epic bosses where you have to fight and defeat them, so the download link is in the description. Check it out! Moving right along to number 3 with Other World Legends, a super hectic action roguelike game where player can explore beautiful other worlds and collect bizarre and funny items and experiment with their combinations to find the best build. The game features super punchy controls and a very satisfying combat experience and many heroes at your choice, each with a distinct fighting style, melee, ranged magic, and also a huge variety of enemies, bosses. <laughs> Down to number 2, we have Worlds End Club. This is an action-adventure puzzle game about a group of 12 kids that are forced to play a death game orchestrated by a mysterious clown. Overall, the game fusses a thrilling story with 2D side-scrolling action. The game features 12 unique and interesting characters and famous locations all over Japan. In the game, player can choices alter the course of the adventure throughout the branching story. Finally, at number 1, we have Truberbrook, now landed on the App Store and Google Play as a premium game. It's an atmospheric mystery adventure game with a great aesthetic that see player take on the role of Hans Tasshauser. Hans is an American physicist who ends up in the village of Truberbrook for a surreal experience. 
So that's it for today, guys. If you feel this video was helpful, then leave a like and don't forget to smash that subscribe button and turn on bell notifications because we put out videos every week. Now, either way, thanks for watching and we'll see you guys next time. Peace.